Well, Chelsea head coach Thomas Tuchel faced more questions about Abramovich today. The Chelsea owner handed over stewardship of the club to their foundation's trustees at the weekend. But a long series of questions regarding the club's ownership, which Tuchel tried to answer as fully as he could, left him visibly frustrated. For me as a, as a coach and in charge of the first team, um, that decision does not change too much in the, in the daily business because I'm in in a daily exchange with Petr Cech and I'm in a very regular exchange with Marina uh, about how to how to improve uh, the, the, the first team and this will not stop because they they stay in charge so on a daily basis it will not change too much for me I guess. With the current state of international affairs though do you think Mr Abramovich's ownership of Chelsea is a problem? I have to say, I'm a bit like it's a bit too much for me to to answer. I'm not aware of any details, and I'm not aware of the the whole situation. And uh, we we all agree that there are situations uh, that are much much more important than, than than football. This this will never change. And situations like 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 war are like of course so much more important. But uh, the the role from Mr. Abramovich is not not to me uh, not on me to comment because I simply don't don't know enough about it. Just on how passionately you spoke a moment ago about the the, the horrors of of war. How much do you hope that? The owner is using any... No, listen, 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 you have to stop. I'm not a politician. You have to stop, honestly. I can only repeat it. And I even feel bad to repeat it because I never experienced war. So even to talk about it, I feel bad because I'm very privileged. I sit here in peace. And I do my, the best I can, but you have to stop asking me these questions. I have no answers for you.